Hey family, welcome back to Lightworks. I hope that you are blessed and well. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. There will definitely be something here for you that your spirit guides or the most high want you to know or focus on. So again, welcome. If the content resonates with you, please hit the like button, share, subscribe, and join the family. We would love to have you. If you are returning, hey soul family what's going on i hope that you guys are doing well that you are staying grounded and keeping your vibrations high and most importantly knowing that you are so very loved appreciated and you are important okay you need to know that so let's go ahead and take a few long deep breaths inhale through your nose positive life force energy and release with your exhale anything that's stressing you, making you feel tension, anxiety, or anything like that. We're gonna release that with the exhale. Spirit, holy angels, ancestors of the highest white light, divine beings of the highest white light, divine ancestors, archangels, spirit guides, please come in and connect with me now. Allow me to channel the current energies for the collective to reveal what we need to know at this time. Let there be none of me and all of you. Most high God, please anoint and authorize everything that comes out of my mouth. Archangel Michael, please protect our energy. Please close the door. Anything that's not the highest white light. And please encamp the angels of protection around us at this time. Archangel Raphael, please help us to heal. Please and thank you. Ashe. All right, y'all. So the book that I was led to is The Heart of the Buddha's Teachings, okay? Really awesome book. So let's see what the passage is for us today. According to Buddhism, a human being is composed of five aggregates, form, feelings, perceptions, mental formations, and consciousness. Let's see where they want me to go from here. Okay, today we're going to tap into form. Form means our body, including our five senses and our nervous system. To practice, to practice mindfulness of the body, you might like to lie down and practice a total relaxation. Allow your body to rest and then be mindful of your forehead. Breathing in, I am aware of my forehead. Breathing out, I smile to my forehead. Use the energy of mindfulness to embrace your forehead, your brain, your ears, your eyes, your nose. Every time you breathe in, become aware of one part of your body. And every time you breathe out, smile to that part of your body. Okay? Interesting. So we're going to stop there. So this is all about scanning your body being intentional about releasing whatever needs to come out from whatever part of the body that you're picking up on. So as I started with the breathing exercises, I always start with on all the videos. And I always say anything that you feel that's causing you tension or stress or anxiety, release that and visualize that leaving your body. This is the same concept. This is getting more detailed in the scanning part of your body. Um, so with deep breathing, somebody here is being guided to really get into deep breathing and relaxation and start to slowly scan through your entire body to see what your body is trying to say to you, okay? So what I'm getting from this is that there are messages from your higher self, your spirit guides, as I said that I just saw 444 a minute ago, they're wanting you to um, 
recognize something that's going on. And since we stopped that form, this talks about the head, okay? This is giving me the energy of the mind, the swords energy. Um, something on your mind heavily, whatever this is, is affecting the heart space. So let's tap in and see. We got lost soul. Voice in the reverse. Throat chakra. Let's see what messages Yeshua. Let's see what messages want to come out today. We got heal me, please. Your body is trying to tell you something, okay? I feel like a part of you is, look, downhill, okay? It's in the reverse, okay? So, I feel like your guides are wanting you to be aware of your thoughts, to be aware of how you're feeling, okay? Angels around you trying to guide you okay trying to show you something holy spirit what messages do you have for our loved one today what should we be aware of do it today stop putting it off <clears throat> tension and stress okay this is a clear message. Powerful. Okay. Your thoughts are very powerful. <clears throat> Manifest in the reverse. Okay. This is because your thoughts. Somebody's in some heavy tension and stress. Somebody's picking up a lot of stress and anxiety as you do these deep breathing. Somebody, God is saying... You need to get busy on this breathing today, okay? You need to really connect to see what you're picking up on each part of your body. Disclaimer, I'm not a mental health, medical doctor, psychological doctor, lawyer, financial advisor, okay? Please do seek those professionals in those areas, okay? For any assistance, also, this is a general reading. It may not apply to everyone. Just take what resonates with you and leave the rest. That being said, somebody here is under some stress that's having a very significant effect on your mental health, on your physical body. You're being guided to really pay close attention to, you, to this today. What else, Holy Spirit? Okay, with rain coming out with protect your energy, this is giving me the energy of this green. This is a greenish color. This is giving me the energy of Archangel Raphael, healing light pouring down over someone with protect your energy. Okay, somebody needs to do some energy cleansing and deep breathing. Okay, there's one here. We got why, okay, and we got heal me, okay? This is for healing. This is why you need to do this. There's some healing work. Archangel Raphael, it's very important. How do you feel? Where are you feeling? Look at this. God is speaking today. Archangel Gabriel is here, throat chakra energy, okay? We got divine timing here. I feel like God is saying now, okay? Do it today. Whatever this stress or energy is over you, this is in the reverse, okay? Ain't no mountain high enough to keep me from getting to you. You're saying this thing is too big for me to overcome. Very important messages coming through here. Holy Spirit, what else? Let's see. Connect 
with your spirit guides. Connect with your higher self. Okay. They're going to make you aware of something. Okay. They need you in this meditative state to connect. Why is do it today? Stop putting it off here, Holy Spirit. Why is do it today here? I'm not taking all of these, but this one on the top is the death card. This is ending. God is saying, stop this. Stop allowing yourself to stay in this stress. Okay, let me help you. Let me teach you. Let me coach you. Let me show you what to do. They do not want you in this crying, sad energy anymore. Why is tension and stress here, Holy Spirit? Let go of your pride, okay? Somebody here feels like they're going to do this on their own. You're going to win. You're going to succeed. You're going to be fine. And you're ignoring the signs. God is saying, release your pride. There's something else here. Why is tension, stress, and pride in the reverse? Holy Spirit, what is this? I'm picking up on. Else? Strategy. So this is somebody feeling like the way that you're doing something, the strategy you're using is going to be Effective is going to bring you to that triumph we just saw, and God is saying not so. Okay, God is saying not so. God needs you to really, really tune in. Okay, thank you, Holy Spirit. I'm hearing you're underestimating the power, the significance of this stress and tension that you are suppressing. Okay, you're you're thinking you're gonna strategize and get past it. You're thinking whatever you're going to do is working. It's not. God is saying no. Why is powerful here? You very well may need to talk to somebody that is a professional, okay? We got third wheel here. They're showing me this because they're saying you need support. You need your guides. You need to connect, okay? Okay. They're going to help you to come to this place of triumph. They're going to help you get past this. Okay, again, we see three people here. This is the energy of you working with your spirit guides. They're going to help you. Let me have one more for powerful, please, Holy Spirit. Yeah, they want you to come out of this. They want to help you. Whatever this energy is, okay? This could very well be some type of hex or something that has been sent to you, okay? This stress, whatever is stressing you out, but they want you to take this seriously, okay? Right behind that natural disaster, okay? This is all clarifying and powerful. There's something that's been sent to you or some type of energy that is on you that needs to be attended to today, okay? Spend time in prayer and meditation. Go out in nature to clear this out, okay? With this rain coming down, they want you to do some uh, cleansing meditations to imagine the healing green, emerald green light, Archangel Raphael pouring throughout, over you, and through you, okay? Why is rain here, Holy Spirit? They want to wash this away, why is rain here? Okay. We have the gift and the triumph, okay? This is going to restore you, okay? This cleansing is going to restore you. It's going to allow you to activate your spiritual gifts. It's going to help you to protect your energy. It's going to bring you back, I'm hearing, okay? Okay cleanse 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 through meditation prayer okay protect your energy why is that here holy spirit because there's a lot going on around you okay conflict a trap okay somebody's trying to change your fate okay somebody's also trying to take from you
protect your energy. This is all clarifying. Protect your energy. Really, seriously. Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Raphael. Call on them. Okay? With marriage here, this is your connection. Your connection to your spirit guides. You are in union with your spirit guides, with the Most High. Okay? Call on them. You do not have to deal with this alone. Okay? They are ready to help you. Why is anxiety here, Holy Spirit? Okay. As long as you're in this energy of withdrawal, they cannot help you. They cannot bring in whatever blessings are meant for you. You cannot believe the blessing that you are meant to be to someone else. Okay. They need you to compromise. They need you to work on this today work on yourself okay so what we read about in the book was lying down and really relaxing and breathing in and out and as you do scan through your body start with your head <sighs> is there any tension in my forehead as I breathe in and out let me acknowledge what that is begin to Explore the ideas. Why is what is this? Why is my head feeling this way? What is on my mind? What do I need to remove from my mind? What am I thinking about? Okay, a lot of source energy, eight of swords that's showing me right now. Okay, very important, y'all. Very, very, very important. Okay, what else, Holy Spirit? Okay, they're drawing me to this day. Okay, we have anger on the bottom of the deck. Disruption, okay? There's a lot going on in someone's mind right now that needs to be cleared. Movement, moving out of this energy. It's like a right now message, okay? Very important for somebody. If you're resonating with this, look at this. Sadness, okay? Somebody is being guided out of this energy out of this space okay they want you to clear your space clear your energy what is the mess this one look at this anxiety somebody is heavy we got anxiety out here twice okay somebody is being guided to really focus in on your body and see what is going on so please 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 take heed we need to figure out what this is. Okay, address it. Journaling is very significant. It's going to help you look at this frustration. Okay, it's going to help you come out of this protection. Your guides are trying to protect you from you at this time. Okay, from your thoughts, from anything that's not serving you, your highest good. They want to bring you into this place of blessings. They want to help you restore your gifts okay so you have to be proactive we got magic coming out here there could very well be somebody sending something your way you are indefinitely being called to cleanse your energy <clears throat> anything else holy spirit we will get you some advice this one strength okay you are very strong. You are very powerful. Right now, you're not able to see that, okay? They're wanting you to really, really stand. This is giving me the energy of standing. This is like podium energy. Stand tall, okay? And you're standing up for yourself by taking the actionable steps to cleanse your energy, to be more in tune with your body, to move out of whatever this energy is that you're in, okay? Again, back to magic, okay? So something is significant. They wanted me to clarify this card. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, why is magic coming up here? Why is, okay. We got Queen of Wands in the reverse. Somebody that's manipulating something. Somebody sending something your way. Look at this. With the devil and the eight of pentacles. This is definitely spell work. Because you 
are some type of star. You're in the public eye. You're being recognized for something. And somebody wants to send you negative energy. Somebody wants you to be in this energy of I'm okay. I got this, okay? But your guys are saying you don't have to do this. Let us help you. Let's get in here. Let's do these breathing exercises. You are the Empress. Let's um, let's invest in your health, okay? Let's take care of you. Why is the Magician with the Devil, Eight of Pentacles, and Queen of Wands in reverse here, Holy Spirit? What is this person's? What is this? Somebody wants you to walk away. They're waiting for you to walk away from something that you're doing. They want to bring these burdens onto you so that you don't reach your wish fulfillment. Nine of Cups in the reverse. That's not going to happen if you are proactive. If you take action to cleanse your energy, to ground yourself, to be in tune with your body so that you can protect yourself against these types of attacks. Okay? Yeah. There are going to be some endings for these people that are trying to send this to you. Okay? God is stepping in. Ace of Wands. Energy wide of correction. God has these people. But this can only work. Whatever this magic is that they're sending. This can only work if you're not cleansing your energy. If you're not staying in a high vibration. If you're not aware of what is your energy and what is not. Okay? Very, very, very important. Alright, let's get a mindful message and we will close this out. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we thank you for the messages. Nurture, okay? Take care of yourself. Start focusing on your health. Balance. This is the energy of justice is going to be served on this situation on these people, but they want your energy to be balanced. They want you to be in tuned, okay, aligned. I surround myself with people I love and enjoy my time with them, but I also take time to nurture my relationship with myself. I have found a healthy balance between being friends and having self-care time. Okay, this is all about self-care. They really want you in this self-care energy right now. What else, Holy Spirit? Together, this is your guide saying, call me, connect with me, let me help you, let me guide you, okay? I love working together with others and how it makes one impossible dream, one's impossible dreams possible. I see there is strength in unity and how much we can accomplish together. Asking for help is not weak. It is powerful. You have powerful here being clarified by third will, which is your spirit guides, okay? And you also have strength here, okay? Together, together, together. Let them help you, okay? Connect through prayer and meditation. They have a lot of messages for you. They want to help you come out of whatever this is, okay? I love you. I really hope that this message helps you cleanse your energy. I'm going to do a little cleansing before we get out of here. Know that God is with you. God loves you. Your guides love you. Okay, do not get in your pride. When you, you need help, call God. This is not one of those 3D situations where you need to feel embarrassed. Okay, God is the creator of all things. Your guides are assigned to you. They, they want to help you. They want to see you grow. Okay, don't get in this prideful energy when it comes to your health. Very important. Let's take a few more deep breaths as we go out, okay? When you inhale, inhale positive life force energy. As you exhale, do a scan through your body to see what is feeling off. We'll feel like to feel what it is that you need at this time.
I love you. I will see you all in the next read. Peace and blessings. Ashe.